awesome. <laughs> this is the grapefruit rosemary. Grapefruit rosemary shrub. Yep. What do you like about it? I love that it has the apple, apple cider vinegar benefits, but has the beautiful flavorings of apple, rosemary, and all of the great combos together. Wow. Fantastic. <laughs> Have you tasted uh, any other ones that you like? I really also like the mango lime. Super fruity and mango with pungent flavor. There you <laughs> go. <of> that? <laughs> Fantastic. Let's get a shot of that. All right. There you go. I know you got to get back to your booth. Thank you very much. This is an awesome product. Tell me about that one. Let me taste oh. it again. Yeah, really intense, flavorful mango. I love it. It's so Thank great. You. Fantastic. <laughs> Thank great. you. Great. Okay, super. Thanks a lot. So, uh, what's your name? Cheers. My name is Mike. And your partner here uh, is Jim. Jim. So, what? Tell me about your brand. What is the False Ox? <laughs> false Ox is named after an animal I made up called the Shapeshifting Caribou or False Ox. It comes from long nights of working and sleep deprivation and, uh, you know, creativity. So uh, we figured our strange drink would need a strange name and a strange mascot and the False Ox is it. Great. So tell me about your drink. Is this a new drink? It is a new, they're both actually very old drinks. One is a shrub, one is a switchel. Shrubs have been around for as long as wine has been around. The ancient Babylonians, ancient Egyptians, they all had vinegar, they all made drinks out of vinegar. And okay. so our version of a shrub is kind of a more European style shrub. Um, great for cocktails, great for natural sodas. And uh, they're made with organic apple cider vinegar, organic cane sugar, fruits, berries, herbs. Keep the sugar content down, kind of make a nice tart and tangy drink. Okay, let me buy the flavors here. All right, so we got raspberry balsamic. Raspberry balsamic. Very nice. Balsamic. Balsamic and vinegar. Drink. Absolutely. Very Why nice. That? Why is that? Why it uh, the raspberries and the balsamic just you know what you're gonna have to try it. Uh, they work really well together. They make a nice tart and refreshing drink. Mango lime, very nice and uh, summery. Pairs nicely with rum. The beaten ginger, also very nice, tart and tangy. I like to drink that one with some vodka and some gin. Celery jalapeno, amazing with some tequila, really nice with some vodka, also on its own in a soda, makes a very interesting combination. The strawberry mint, very nice kind of summery classic flavors, pairs very nicely with some spiced rum. In a soda, it's a, a really nice alternative to uh, sugary artificial drinks. And my favorite is the grapefruit rosemary. Uh, there you go on the English side. Why is it your favorite? You know what, the combination of the grapefruit and the rosemaries, for some reason, uh, I don't know why I like it. It's nice and refreshing, but it also has uh, some of the herbal bitterness of the rosemary, and uh, it just makes for a really refreshing drink. So what do you guys do? Wake up one day and decide let's do something different? <laughs> these are really different drinks. I did try them. Yeah, yeah. And they're very different. Yeah. We're uh, waiting on the schoolyard, waiting for our daughters to come out of school, and uh, sitting there, wasting time, and we both like to drink. and both have uh, kids with allergies and so we like to make kind of natural products. I make, used to make a lot of beer. My wife can't drink beer so she told me to make something that she could drink. So after trying kombucha, which I didn't like, and water kefir, which I didn't like, uh, we came up and made a drinking vinegar, which I really liked. We made lots of them and our friends and family kept drinking them on us. So we figured we'd make a go of it. So again, you pair these with uh, alcoholic beverages. Yep. Also with uh, makes a nice kind of grown up soda. You know, uh, we have friends of ours who have a brewery and they're serving this on tap as their designated driver drink. For people who don't like alcohol, uh, it makes a kind of, uh, like an adult tasting soda. It's not sugary, it's a little bit tart and tangy, and uh, you know, you feel like you're having kind of an adult beverage without the, all the sugar and artificial flavors. What's your name? My name's Mike. And you are? Jim. So uh, guys, these are what, concentrates or you don't drink the whole bottle, you have to dilute it, is that yeah, correct? Absolutely. Each bottle makes between 12 to 16 drinks. You add uh, about an ounce to three quarters of an ounce to some mineral water. Uh, you add about a three quarters of an ounce to an ounce to a cocktail. You can even use them in cooking. Raspberry balsamic works really nice in a salad dressing. Celery jalapeno, you can use that in some coleslaw or some potato salad. Makes a really nice addition to a Caesar as well. Um, they all have, uh, you know, some pretty interesting culinary uses as well, being having the tartness of the vinegar, a little bit of sweetness, and uh, loads of fruit flavor. Great.
Now what's this over here you got? The switch oil is an old switch drink. Oil. Let's switch to the switch yeah. oil. The switch oil is an old drink, comes from originally from the Caribbean, uh, made its way up to New England where they used to call it Haymaker's Punch. It was a, kind of a home remedy, field and farm workers used to make it. The organic apple cider vinegar would kill the germs in the water, the ginger would settle your stomach, and the sweetener would make it all palatable. And they used to drink it by the bucket, by the gallon, and in the evenings, tip a little booze into it and have a nice cocktail mixers. Okay. We so have, what, uh, what do you got? We got organic apple cider vinegar, organic cane sugar, and ginger. In which one? In these three. This these one three. has organic cane sugar and organic blackstrap molasses. This one has juniper, and we have a zero sugar version, our unsweetened, uh, that has organic apple cider vinegar, ginger, and a spice blend that lends some sweetness to, uh, to balance it all out. So where would you drink these drinks? I drink, drink these straight, all. They're not diluted, correct? No, not diluted. Drink the whole thing. Drink a natural thing, hydrator, right. natural electrolytes. It's an energy drink that doesn't have anything artificial in it whatsoever. The ginger is an immune system booster. The organic apple cider vinegar is good for gut health, good for inflammation, good for lots of things. And you know, overall, they taste really nice and they're made with all natural products. Okay, you got blackstrap molasses here. Absolutely. In a drink. In a drink. What inspired you to make that one? The original switchels from the Caribbean were made with organic blackstrap molasses and ginger. And uh, we thought we'd throw this in one in there. It's also one of my favorite flavors. I love organic blackstrap molasses. I, I grew up on the East Coast, that's what we had. You know, the rum trade from the Caribbean all the way up to from there all the way to Newfoundland and everywhere in between there's blackstrap molasses and that's one of the flavors I grew up. Well, so what are people saying here at the show? I know you just... They're, it's a lot of education. Not a lot of people have heard of shrubs and switchels, but when they do try it and when they know that it has organic apple cider vinegar and it's a much more palatable way of taking it than say taking a teaspoon on your own, they really enjoy it and they buy some and uh, tell their friends and family and they bring them over and they have more drinks and onwards and upwards. <laughs> well, I, want to, I want to tell my friends and family, where do we go? What's your contact info? Website? Yeah, you can go to our website, fallsocks.com. We have our uh, where to find us map. We're in about 15 stores in and around the city. Hopefully soon to be in many more. And uh, yeah, we're pretty new, but you know, it's a good place to start and hopefully we'll be everywhere. Great. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Okay. Thank you. Cheers. Cheers. Alright, I'm gonna do you have a celery jalapeno?